hi guys and welcome back to my channel i am yelena if you are new hi hello and welcome and if you are not new what's popping <laughs> so in today's episode we have something very interesting so i'm featuring this palette take me home huda beauty or huda beauty huda i just call her huda and this cost $35, $35 enough. Before I get into my story, what I'm going to do is use my Ambrosia Cosmetics IFX Eyeshadow Primer. This primer is a white base. So the reason why I'm using a white base is just in case the pigmentation in 200, I went to buy one thing, two things. Okay, maybe three things. And I saw that they were selling some makeup products, so I decided to check them out, right? So I'm looking at the glass case and looking at what they have. They have like foundation, eyeshadows, they have pencils, you name it, lip gloss, lipstick. So I see it and I happen to see some Huda Beauty and i saw some kylie jenna as well right now with the huda beauty i was like oh my god what is that i don't know this palette i really don't know this palette i've never seen it before um but then too i know i've not been involved in makeup that long so i figured who knows maybe it was something that she probably came up with much earlier now please note i did not purchase this palette because I thought it was original. I purchased this palette because I figured it probably something shady about this, right? $35 for Huda Beauty in this day and age. Listen to me. Impossible. Because I knew I wanted this rose gold palette and it was like $650 TT dollars. And the foundation is like 400 400 plus. So I know this is Mrs. Who the cat are we talking about here? So I know $35 is unreal. So I decided I'm going to pick this up. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to check this out when I get home. Mm -hmm. This kind of darkish pink shade here to be a transition shade. I'm going to use this as my crease shade. And then I'll use this one as my transition shade. Okay, right? so I'm going to start with my crease shade first. And dab 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 <laughs> so I saw it y'all see in this though it had a Huda Beauty lipstick too would you believe and I picked it up and I handed it to the girl and I told the girl I was getting it but somehow she didn't um I don't know if she didn't hear me or what either way I did not get it and she did not cash for it so it's not like I paid for something that I did not get so I was like okay no scene we have a small thing because I was going to feature both products. I said, okay, let me see if I can Google this Take Me Home Huda Beauty and see what is the scene with this palette. This is all I found with it. So I was like, yeah, this is it. And it had two different sets of palettes to choose from. And I chose the warmer tone, which is the one that I have because I didn't really fancy the cool tone one, which was this one here. I find oh it's so blah. It's linked to a Facebook site, and other than that, I have never seen anything else. I went to Huda Beauty's website. No take me home palette. Okay, so this palette non-existent. These people literally created a palette and stamp Huda Beauty's name on it. Okay then, weird. Then. I decide to YouTube it, not a video insight. Now that I've blended out that pink shade, the same shade that I said I was going to use as a transition shade is what I'm going to apply above it. Oh my gosh, it's such a pretty shade. Since both of my creases are cut, now, let me contemplate what it is I'm going to put. Lighter shade in the palette. I'm thinking about starting with that on the inner and then probably going into a shimmer. 
Right, so with the rest of my story, your girl started to get bummy. It not on YouTube, it not on she website, it only on these really weird named pages. So I am like, okay, well let me at least look to see if what the ingredients are, just to be sure I'm not putting on any lead on my eyes or any kind of toxic thing guess what not a damn ingredient on the palette a lie again you mean you really mean to tell me that i can be putting on anything right now solid not saying take me home and joke so i say now i'll make things right with the lord i ask the lord for forgiveness I tell my family I love them and you know I really appreciate them because I'm so sure you know God forbid this is even my last video everything's showing up real good all the scene is white off-white cream apple white I think I'm gonna go with this pink one what do you guys think you can barely see this pink wow let me try wetting my brush. Let's do this again. And then back with this one, and then I'm gonna end it with this black. Let me finish this next eye, apply eyeliner and lashes, and I'll be back. We're gonna do this face real quick. So I'm about to prime with my Fenty Beauty. I think this works perfectly with my Super C. Now I'm going to apply my Maybelline Super C Foundation in the shade 330, which is Tuffy. Time for me to conceal. I'm going to use my Instant Age Rewind Eraser from Maybelline. This is in the shade Sand. Because it's really bright, I don't need much of it. Then I'm going to take another shade in that concealer brand. It's called Caramel. See how that blends? Now I'm going to go back with the base of the blender so that I can blend everything well. Now that that is all blended to my liking, time to set it. My Duma Blend Setting Powder. Then I'm going to set the rest of my base with my Fit Me. This is in the shade Toffee. Then you know I next use my BH Cosmetics Contour Palette. Highlighter from my Revlon Peach Glow Palette. Now I'm gonna sort out my lower lash line. This bronze shade down here. Time to set my face using my Mario Badescu. <laughs> I have this lip paint from Ellie Girl. I feel I should put it on my lip. It's not bad. I just wanna get to my teeth though. Minty. Face complete. Hey, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Let me look, fix my hair. I look a little cute. Uh, I say, look a little cute. I'm actually, just gonna fix my hair and I'm gonna be right back. So, now that I've popped on another half wig, 
some of y'all know we fed up of it. But according to my Instagram followers, they are not. <laughs> I got this hair from Confidence by Baby Jam, of course. Um, it's really black though and it's extremely straight in comparison to my real hair Which is the only downside to it, but I love this body weave Kind of vibe it has going on. I really 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 love it. It is so cute I decided to pair it with this leopard bandeau that I purchased But other than that guys, I am getting some heavy heavy breast cancer awareness vibes from this entire look comment down below and let me know if that is what you are getting as well or should i do another look to commemorate breast cancer awareness in this month of october if you think this take me home not to heaven because i'm still alive and my eyes feel fine palette saying or else thing like this video comment and tell me listen to me i am completely blown away now let me give my points i thought the matte shades were amazing it's extremely pigmented it is i mean although i still used a white base i mean if it was trash it would have still proven to be trash right but the matte shades are very pigmented they show off they show up they show out and the shimmer shades is trash the shimmer shades is toots okay it is a struggle to see the pink shimmer shade on my eyelid listen to me using it dry using it wet i don't think it's showing up as i would have liked it to or at least what i expected to considering how much the matte shades were showing off but it's $35 and it's not even Huda Beauty only. So what we could do? You gotta be eight. But other than that, uh, I am loving this pink look. This is our look. This is our whole look. I don't know, it's like ever since I've discovered half up, half down with this half wig. My first half wig, I feel like I could half up, half down everything. To be honest, this hair is not as voluminous it's not you know as big as the others or as full as the others so i can do the half up half down but i still need to make sure that there's hair in the back to kind of hide the wig now don't forget to like comment and subscribe i love you guys so much and until next time thank you for watching this video bye <laughs> should play in the end. Do it. <laughs>